Drop County, no stranger to wildfires, and those who live there want to make matters take matters into their own hands. The Bastrop County Complex Fire of 2011 saw close to 1,700 homes destroyed in the most destructive fire in state history. Then just this year, on a smaller scale, the Hidden Pines Fire near Smithville, that took out 64 homes. And now homeowners say they want first-class fire protection for the future. As KXAN's Amanda Brandeis explains, they've created their own task force to figure out what went right during the Hidden Pines Fire and what they have left to do. It, it was a big shock because if there was one house I thought would not uh, uh, suffer from a fire, it was this one. But uh, as you can tell, the fire got it. One of 64 homes where the fire showed no mercy. I don't know whether they're depression as a clinical term, but uh, many people are close to it. And Jim Boyle lives next door. His home was spared. When we heard about the fire, we were told that our home was gone, that every house in this area was gone. While the family that lived here won't be coming back, the task force wants to make sure that others feel confident rebuilding. We've done quite a few open records requests. Uh, we're talking to first responders. We're uh, talking to fire science experts. We're trying to learn as much as we can. Jim and his wife helped form the Lost Pines property owners fire protection task force because one day they'd like to have neighbors again. We're down to six homes at the moment out of 20. They believe assistants like bulldozers should have gotten to the fire quicker and that volunteer firefighters need more resources. One volunteer fire department had three fire trucks that broke down during the fire. Some of the fire hydrants don't have much pressure. There are a lot of concerns. And they say for an area prone to wildfires, that won't cut it. Amanda Brandeis, KXAN News. The task force plans to issue a report in February. If you'd like to join this group or send them tips and information, we have all those details for you at KXAN.com. The state investigators have ruled the cause of the Hidden Pines fire as accidental. Bastrop County is issuing its own report into the firefighting response. That's coming up next year. The Texas A&M Forest Service is posting the winter outlook today. Although the current El Nino will lower the wildfire risk, this is the time to take steps to protect your home and your property. With the rain we've had over the last several months, it's been great for grass and plants. All the growth means new fuel for fires, though. Add to that all the leaves that have fallen off the trees and other dry brush around. Cut and clear brush away from your home by at least 30 feet, the experts say. If you need to burn any brush piles or trash, make sure you are not in a burn ban area. Beware of windy days as one spark could spark a wildfire. We've got these tips and more available at the weather blog at KXAN.com.